In this video, learn how to sign and sideload IPA of any apps or game in your iPhones or iPads using this newly launched free app without any computer. The name of the free app is Sierra. It has been recently released, which allows you to sideload IPA files without computer. To access IPA Signer, tap on this icon as shown. Next, long press on Import IPA button as demonstrated. It offers two ways of IPA sideloading, which are Sign App and Smart Signature. The Sign App option will let you sign and sideload any app without computer like you see in the video. Very simple, just select IPA, tap on the desired IPA file, and you will see a pop-up like this. Just tap on Install to sign and install it right away. As you can see, the target app is sideloaded successfully. The smart signature allows to to fully customize the IPA file. Let me show how. Just long press on the import IPA button, tap on smart signature, and select your desired IPA file. In my case, I will select Scarlet app. Now you can completely change the name of the app, so let me do that. But the issue is that I already have Scarlet installed, so I have to duplicate the app. So using this smart signature feature, I can duplicate any IPA. Just change the bundle identifier, all you have to do is insert any letters or numbers at random. You can also change the icon of the app. To change the icon, just tap on the default icon. Let me change the icon to that of eSign. Talking about eSign, if you want to learn how to use eSign to sideload IPA without computer, click on the i button on top corner. Back to the video, using Smart Signature, you can also back up the data of the app, although it's currently in beta, so I will pass. You also have the option to either just sideload the IPA or export it to your device. The next features allow users to patch any app and apply tweaks, and also you can add and remove tweaks in Dialibs format. Once you have customized the IPA, just tap on Sign App to start the signing and sideloading process. Tap on install when you get pop-up like this. And D as you can see, we have successfully sideloaded Scarlet app, having a different icon and a different name. Although it's Scarlet, but it's having the icon of eSign app. You can duplicate unlimited number of apps or games. This feature actually don't come free if you see the competitors. It is absolutely free as of now in Sierra. Other notable features it offers are, importing your own certificate, for app signing, and option to add app repositories. But if you do not have your own certificate, don't worry, just use the enterprise certificate that comes with Sierra app by default for free. So to install and set up Sierra app, visit this website on Safari as shown on the video, which is Sierra. Dot app. Once you are on the website, tap on this download now button, and then tap on download for ios on the next page tap on get sierra highlighted in blue as you can read here it warns about getting revoked easily but keep watching to learn how you can block revokes completely once you click on get sierra you will land on this page where it may ask you to watch a video or download any app you do not have to watch or download anything rather just tap on it when it opens a new window completely just tap on watch a video and then it will open a new window. Just close the window and go back to the Sierra download page and stay on this page till it turns green with a tick mark. Now just tap on done and next tap on install when you get this pop-up. This will start sideloading the Sierra app as this is sideloaded using an enterprise app, we must trust the certificate. To do so, launch settings, then VPN and device management. Find the certificate and simply tap on trust to finish the process. Now to prevent revokes, go back to the Sierra website, onto the download page here, as shown on the video. Tap on get Sierra, and you will see this pop up, which says, click here to get anti blacklist. So just tap on it, and tap on allow. And it will download a profile. Just go back to the VPN and device management section in settings. Tap on the downloaded profile, and finally install it. And that's it, out whole setup is complete. If you want to play Nintendo Wii and GamesCube games, your iOS device, watch the next video.